So we're out driving and we found, look, gunshots. We found a fireman, Michigan State Firemen's Association Memorial. And I'm pretty sure, I don't know if you guys know this, but my grandpa was a Detroit firefighter. Wow, here's a whole bunch from Detroit right here. Um, my grandpa was a firefighter for the city of Detroit. But I think these are names of people who may have died because it says the ultimate sacrifice. I'm not really sure. I'm going to have to look it up and see what more I can find out. But here's a whole bunch of Detroit ones right here, Jamie. Yeah. Jamie's over there looking. But it's pretty cool. Yeah, my grandpa was a Detroit fireman, and we saw the thing that said Fireman's Memorial, and we're like, oh, let's go check that out. This is actually pretty cool. I forgot to tell them why we were out driving around. I'll show you that in a minute. Right now we're looking at all, look at all the names. Let's see if I can find, maybe there's more information down there. They're in alphabetical order. On that side, they're in alphabetical order. Here's more, a bunch from Detroit on this side. There's the fireman. See this? This is an old fire alarm. We actually, you push, pull this and push this down. We actually have one of these. My mom and dad have one that my grandpa had that had, I don't know if the light's still hooked up to it, but you could pull it down and the light would, and the siren would go off. When uh, I was little, my grandpa used to have it in his basement and you could go over there and you could pull the thing down and the light would go off and it was the coolest thing. We used to do it all the time when we were kids and now my mom and dad have it. There's a really cool horse cart with a hose on it. So the reason that we went for a ride in the first place was to go buy this. Bought a trailer. My little dog cart will fit on here hopefully. And a lawnmower and other things. Yeah, we bought that. I think there was a forest fire here. I don't know when, maybe last year or the year before. But this is definitely all burned forest. We're just outside of Ross Common. I don't remember there being a fire down here, but that sure looks like fire. Those are burnt trees. Maybe it was last year, I don't know. Yeah. Wow, look at them all. There's all kinds of burnt trees. Way back there. Oh, look at all that. Yeah, so more burnt trees. Dead. All burnt trees. And see, a long time ago, not a long time ago, but there was definitely a fire over here, but then they cleared it all out. So I'm assuming these are small trees. Mm. So I bet when this fire happened, these trees started to grow back. I don't know. Mm. I don't know. I'll have to look in the news. There's, look, all these little trees over here are burned too. Them little trees are burned. These little trees are burned. Hmm. I have no idea. We'll have to look it up. I'll put some pictures in because the one of my memory cards no longer uh, likes to record things. I'll record and it'll error out. Um, I just bought a new one and I actually, I think I have it in this camera. Um, I have to remember to take everything off of this one and throw it away when I get home. Because I kind of sucked. I got some photos that I will insert after this. We just saw an eagle on the side of the road, which was pretty cool. Just hanging out in the field. And I was, the video wouldn't work anyway because he flew into the sun. So and big black bird flying. It was super windy. Oh, is so it? So I'm sure all we would have heard was yeah. <laughs> Hold on, I'll imitate it for you. So, <laughs> so the photo should be... Yeah, the photo working. should turn out pretty good. We'll see. Ooh, Tell bird. me what you think. Here's some it's, photos. Right, it was a big bird. <laughs> yeah, he was huge. He was cool. Deer. Where? Way out there. Where? Oh, there's deer out there. <laughs> there's deer everywhere. Deer. Here comes Greg. This is gonna be a bad idea. 